State Representative Joel Jones has rejected a plea deal. The deal would have required Jones to plead guilty to four misdemeanors and two felonies in exchange for DUI charges to be dropped. Jones is set for a new hearing December 10th. He faces drunk driving charges after he was arrested in April and charges for allegedly taping a handcuff key to the bottom of his foot. He was ordered to take a mental health examination back in September and is currently free on bond. Police are investigating a deadly freeway crash in Sterling Heights. This was yesterday on M59 near Mound. Police say a driver was traveling east in the westbound lanes and caused the accident. Five vehicles involved in the crash. Police say the wrong way driver, a 50 year old from Hamtramck, died from their injuries. A 24 year old was also hurt. Police still investigating whether drugs or alcohol may have been used by the deceased driver. A trend in the right direction as gasoline prices continue to drop. According to AAA, gas prices in Michigan have decreased seven cents compared to last week. Drivers are now paying an average of $3.25 per gallon. That means drivers filling up a full 15 gallon tank will pay an average of $48. A spokesperson for AAA says prices at the pump have fallen for the fourth consecutive week. New at 530. Tonight, I am taking you inside Amazon. Have you ever wondered how your purchases get from this facility to your doorstep? We're also going to share an important piece of advice, what you need to know right now in order to make sure that your purchases get to family and friends by the holidays. Brian Hank also searching for answers in Flint. An eight-figure lawsuit has been filed in the explosion that killed two people, but it's coming as investigators are still trying to figure out what caused it. Nick. Any clues as to why there are fewer toy donations coming in and where you can go to help out this year? We're going to fill you in.